During this extraordinary time, many of us are feeling emotions like uncertainty, confusion, fear, distress, and loneliness. And that's okay. What we're here to do though, is to share with you some incredible tips that we feel are gonna help you manage your day. So number one is stick to routine. So that's getting up early and sleeping on a regular time. Take a shower, dressed up, get up, you know, get ready as if you were going to do your normal day to day, right? Do your hair, do your makeup. Get up, do your workout first thing if that's something that you would normally do. Clean a room or certain areas of your house that you've maybe neglected over the past couple of months. Um, and if you have children involved them in that family plan structure. Number two would be to maintain your connections. So that would be FaceTiming your family, your friends, and checking up on all your peers. Talk about how you're feeling with everything going on. Open up about your feelings and ask them how they're feeling as well. It's important that we're allowing that escape for those emotions and maybe somebody has some tips for you. And make sure to check up on those that you know and love that you know may be alone at this time and really, really, really need somebody to reach out to them. Engage in hobbies and things you like. Do karaoke. We'll cook. I've been doing a lot more baking with my kids just because it occupies them and it helps to teach them how to use specific kitchen items. Or start a new hobby. That could be drawing, reading. Puzzles, dance, exercise. Those ones are all so, so easy and fun. I dance every day. Manage uncertainty by staying present and in the moment. The best place to be is here and now taking each day at a time, each task at a time, and one breath at a time. The world is a big place, and we don't know what's gonna happen or how long is this gonna go on for. The only thing you can control is what you're doing to help. So obviously we all know what that is, stay inside. Train your mind to focus on the moment and to acknowledge thoughts and feelings without judging them. Focus on what you can in this exact moment by putting one foot in front of the other, taking social media breaks and closing your eyes and focusing on your breath to get centered. Engage in well-being practices, whether it's meditation. For me, meditation has been a great tool to help me to cope with this. So I do meditation every day, first thing in the morning for 30 minutes. Exercise is a good outlet, good way to express themselves. Starting a gratitude journal as well, like pointing out and picking out things that you're grateful for every single day. Um, congratulate yourself on any kind of successes that you've had in the last couple weeks. Congratulate your friends because you don't know what's going on on an everyday basis. So with that, we thank you and we are here together and we will show the world that together we are stronger. Peace out.